Hey, it's Dr. Trish Lee. I'm here to tell you how to perform your home brain performance assessment. Okay, so you signed up for your home brain map, you bought your Muse headband, you received your sensor and paste in the mail from my team. Now you are ready to perform your assessment. So this is what has happened in the background. We have scheduled your brain performance assessment in an app called MindLift. It's M-Y-N-D-L-I-F-T. It has the picture of a turquoise arrow facing up. You need to download that app. When you download that app, I, my team, will have already sent you login credentials so that you can get into the app. When you log in using your email and the password that we've sent to you, the app will open up immediately and it will prompt you to take your own assessment. And it's just that easy. So when you're prompted, what you need to do is get your headband. Here's your MuseCom headband. It goes on like this under your hair, of course, and it has five sensors in the frontal lobe. It has two in the temporal and it has an external port back here on the right hand side of the earpiece. You connect the sensor, here's the sensor. You connect the sensor to that earpiece, plug it in, it's easy peasy. And then this part is what you will use to take your map. You get your paste out, here's the paste. And what the paste does is it conducts the information in your brain and it sends it to the sensor so that your brain performance profile can be taken. So you scoop a bit, just a heaping amount. Let's see if you can see it. A heaping amount, not too much, not too little, just enough so it's heaping. And you use that paste to be able to connect the sensor to your head. You put the headband on and you listen and you watch for the prompts in the app. The app is very easy to use. What it does is it will walk you through the 28 minute brain performance assessment. It will tell you where to put the sensor, when to move it. It will ask you if you've gotten a good reading and you want to keep going. There is a task at the end. Uh, some people think it's longer than it should be. It's not that long, but it's designed to challenge your brain a little bit. So hold on during that task, you'll do just great. And give yourself one hour to take this assessment. It only takes 28 minutes, but I wanna make sure you have enough time so that you're relaxed and you can, you know, it's a very indicative uh, picture of how your brain is performing. Then when you get done, performing your assessment, the results are going to show up for you immediately in the app. It will be in the other, in the more tab under assessments, and it'll be there for you forever. So you can always go back and see your assessment results, but I will be able to access them in an online platform. And then what happens is you will have hopefully already scheduled time with me. And if not, I will reach out to you to try to meet with you as soon after you perform your assessment so that I can go through the results with you without you having to wonder what they mean for you. So using the Calendly link that you have been given, schedule that appointment with me and try to schedule it for just a little bit after when you plan on taking the brain map. That way we can meet and I will go through your findings for 45 minutes. I won't leave anything out. I'll show you everything that you need to know about how your brain is performing. If you have any thoughts or questions, you can reach out to my team at info at drtrishley.com and we can help you out and move you through the process. It's very, very easy and I've worked with many, many people of all ages who have been able to get them through themselves through the process. Okay, go do it and I cannot wait to be able to spend time with you to tell you how your brain is performing and how we can optimize it. Okay, I'll see you soon.